Hello and welcome to a series of NX Admin videos from Sherpa Design. My name is Matt Martin. In this video, I'm going to cover downloading and installing NX. So let's get started. I've got Chrome loaded here. Let's go ahead and just go up to the Siemens Support Center and then look for NX, Downloads, and here you can pick the version that you want to download. Okay, so NX2406. You've got 2406, which is the main series here. Here you get the NX What's Changed and NX Tool Reports, Add-ons, Help, Batch, if you want to set it up like a headless version of NX where it's just running batch file kind of work. Um, if you look here in Add-ons, this is where you're going to find other tools like uh, Easy Fill, some, of the NX, some, some NX Tools, your die design, things like that. So next 2406 and here's the zip file. It is 13 gigabytes. It will take a little while to download. There's also a, uh, a SHA-512 here. So you can, if you download both of these, you can run a command tool to make sure that your zip file is actually correct in the download. So I can right click on this, save link as, drop it into my repository. I've downloaded it to my C temp, but just while we're here, let's take a look at this. So you got your your what's new in NX2406. You've got your release notes, uh, install guide for Linux, install guide for Windows. So there's some there's some decent information right here. Let's take a look at my C temp. So we're gonna unzip this. I like to use seven zip for all my Siemens uh, uh, unzipping. Okay, I'm unzipped. Open up the file. I can right click on launch exe and, and uh, run as administrator and it opens up this window here where you can install NX, view documentation, uh, install the launcher, you can install via map drive and then you can go in and obtain Siemens license server from the support center. Now, if you don't want to do this you can go into the NX install directory or the NX directory you can just go to setup exe run that as administrator and it takes you right to the install. So. Okay, English, that's just for the installer. Computing space requirements. So this one here says feature contains required files and uh, it's compiling the costs for these features right now. So if you go into browse, in fact, you gotta wait for it to finish. I like to stick mine in C Siemens 2406. And when you do that, it's gonna recalculate the cost of installing. Um, so this one it says that it's going to uh, require this this much. It's basically going to it's going to take 23 gigabytes. Okay, you can look through here and see the different things you may want to install. Okay, so if you are doing tooling and die design or NX join, you'd want to install that entire feature on the hard drive, and it clears the X. It also recalculates and when I come back up here now it's 24 gigabytes so depends on the on the, the features you want to have installed you can pick the ones that you want and install them as needed okay so next your license server the NX user interface is going to be in English or whatever you've decided to put in there if you don't have if you didn't put in Localizations, English is only, your only choice. Here's a summary page and install. Again, this is going to take a little while to install. And when it's done installing, you can show the installer log. And the installer log is big. It is 500,000 lines big. So if something went wrong with your install, Check your installer log. Let's see if NX is running. NX2406 looks good so far. And there's NX2406. Yay! So let's test to make sure NX is up and running. And I can open up a part and it works just fine. File, utilities, select bundles. You can see I've got my bundles have been selected. 
Let's do another video for licensing options and how to set this up to where it automatically pulls your license bundles in. Thank you and have a great day.